Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Nicholas here. Um, going to give you guys a quick update today. Um, got some eggs from the leopard geckos, and uh, I actually got a new addition to show you guys. So let's go ahead and get started with that. Okay, so first of all, as you guys know, I uh, have my leopard gecko breeding colony together right now. The male bell sunglo, and the female patternless is in here somewhere. And uh, female normal is actually down here for now, just uh, kind of recuperating, fattening up after uh, she just laid her eggs a couple days ago. So, um, so far I've gotten a clutch from the female normal and a clutch from the female patternless, so I'm just going to show them to you right now, the eggs. Uh, incubating at 85 degrees. There's the clutch from the patternless. It was about, let's see, uh, about two weeks ago. No, not two weeks ago, like a week and a half ago. Um, and then there's the clutch from the normal. Can't really see them, the eggs are kind of covered in eco-earth. That's what I have in their lay box. So, um, yeah, but that's, uh, just wanted to give you guys a quick update on that. So, I already got some eggs, and I'm hoping to get some more this year. So, we should be looking at some pretty cool babies this year. So, uh, definitely be expecting that, and that'll be really cool. So, um, now I'm just going to show you guys my new addition. So, uh, yeah, every th everyone's doing great in here. Um, all the ball pythons and everything. Um, oh, yeah, um, before. Before I show you guys my new addition, uh, I think I told you guys that I, um, my female ball python uh, was going to give to Reed for a little while. He's going to breed it. Well, uh, he's, she's over at his house right now breeding, and she's actually uh, locked with an Enchi right now. So that'll be really cool. She'll be getting some Enchis and some normals out of that. So that'll be really cool. So I uh, actually don't have her right now. All I have in the adult rack is the uh, adult male normal. Duke, so uh, she's gonna be over there for a little while longer, but that's uh, definitely some cool that's going on. So uh, yeah, back to the new edition. Here it is. It's a male jungle carpet python. Yeah, put a light over it so you guys can get a better idea of how crazy his colors are. Um. All right, so um. Yeah, so here he is. Oh, crap. Um, yeah, so here he is. The male jungle. And, uh, pretty much I got this guy from Reed. Uh, as you guys know, Reed, so Car Reptiles, is a, um, big jungle carpet breeder. He, uh, he's got a lot of these guys and he breeds them. Um, this one is actually not one of his babies, but, uh, it's still a really good looking one and I actually got it for free from him. So that's really cool really nice looking it's got amazing colors never bitten anyone it's never even struck at me or reed because um, I work with them over at reeds I clean out their cages and stuff and a lot of the babies are just mean little butts and he's the nicest one out of them and he's actually not really a baby he's kinda more of a juvie but he's just really nice looking and nice the tamest animal ever so uh, really pleased with this so I just wanted to say thanks to reed um, really cool looking snake uh, you guys can tell he just ate yesterday. Ate a rat pup and a weaned rat. But he's going to be moving up to small rats for sure. So, um, yeah. So that's pretty much the new addition, guys. Um, and, uh, yeah. So, uh, we'll go ahead and put him back in the rack. He's uh, just in the hatchling rack. He's got a six quart. So he's just perfectly fine in there. Pinstripe. So yeah, that's uh, basically it, guys. Uh, thanks for watching, and definitely stay tuned in for some cool leopard gecko babies coming up, and some more cool stuff. So thanks a lot for watching, guys. Rate, comment, subscribe. Out.